Yeah, I got a half hour. So do you think we can finish the rest of this in a half hour? It's possible. According to our intel, there's a cartel death truck that collects corpses across San Mateo and delivers them to yeah. someone called El Pasolero. Intercept the truck and force the driver to give up El Pasolero's location. Truck's moving, by the way. Yeah, I know. You gotta try to get him out of it without killing him. I mean, that should be easy. Should be. Fucking hell! Should be. Planned. Okay, there he is up ahead. Shoot out the tires or something. Scare him out of there, maybe. Eyes on the truck. We need this fucker alive. He's already got a loading pack full of goddamn bodies. I'm gonna have to move pull in front of it so I can get the last tire. You got out. You got out. He's trying to hide behind it. Transfer from Bowman. Looks like she was able to dig up some background on El Pozolero. They deserve a Viking burial. Video. When I was a kid, we used to live over the train tracks. Every time a train went past, I would run into my mother's bed and she'd assure me there was no such thing as monsters. She was such a liar. El Pozolero, also known as the Stewmaker. Sometimes the cartel needs a dead body to completely disappear without a trace. In such cases, they ship the cadavers off to San Mateo. The first thing El Pozolero does is place the bodies inside a barrel, which he fills with caustic soda, sodium hydroxide, then covers the drums, stirring occasionally. After 24 hours, there's nothing left but a thick sludge, a stew. He pours this into a pit. Any leftover teeth or bone fragments, he smashes into dust. Last year, more than 300 people disappeared in San Mateo. Their families have no idea if their loved ones are alive or dead. They can't have proper burials. They can't have closure. The only one who knows what truly happened to these people is El Pozolero, the monster who melted them. Well then. This guy's gonna be neat. I don't like this. No idea what We've got a locate. Kind of like a little nervous. Hold up. It said there are a lot of variables at play. There aren't a lot of variables. Right. We just don't know what they are, so we're taking everything into account. We need a covert way in. I want to see El Pozolero before he sees us. Well, she should have stopped talking in general. We've got a location. There we go. El Pozolero. Go and 
get this bastard and bring him to me, he's got a lot to answer for. We. So we're gonna need to abduct him. Yep. <sighs> Is that the fucking truth? You know what, I hope she does the same thing that, to him, that he's done to other people. Now that is karma. Yeah, I'm about to say, you might want to drive up or something. Put this stuff right here. The drone is up. Binoculars. We... Small group of tangos. Well, I found the nest I'm gonna go hide in for a bit. Let's see, where can we go? There's alarm, automatic doors, fuck. Okay, I found the sweet spot. I think I can hit it from here. Which one? Varum box right in front of us. The alarm is disabled. Okay. This guy's all alone. Just need him to stop. He is the only no he isn't. That's one less bad guy. There's so many guys in buildings, this is gonna be annoying. I thought that was a sweet spot, I guess I was wrong. What, there's a second alarm tower? Yeah. Oh. Got where? It. Well, I think there's a third. Yeah. Very far in the back. There's one more. I think there's only one more. Okay, I found a way in. Too, actually, I did a front goddamn gate. Okay, there's a guy there. Backdoor him. You know what? What? These guys are absolutely horrible at singing. Oh, with their random Santa Blanca chant? Yeah. Okay, someone right here. Hey, there's a weapons case. Neat. I could take him out, but there's also a chance that it'll hit a tree and somehow not kill him, because that happens a lot in this game. 
There's a lot of stuff that happens in this game. Jeez, this place is so big. Can't get their file in there. The sweet spot on the alarm is towards the uh, Pointed towards the way opposite of us, basically, just so you know. Okay. I think I see it, actually. Hold up. Let me get into kind of a more covered area before looking. Why am I not able to... I see it, but... It's a risky shot for me, where I am. I'm just going to make my way around to take out the guys here so we can keep slowly scooting up. don't know exactly which way this guy is. Okay, good. He's messing with something here. If you want, you can scoot up. I took everyone down on this level. We just need the guy in the tower. That's my main concern. And the rest of the people that hasn't been spotted. I don't have a shot on the guy in the tower. Okay. There's another road there. Looking at a small group of tangos. Okay, I took out the the alarm. Okay. There's Still a big a guy there. I have a possible shot, but I really don't want to risk it. Yeah, I know. That's why I'm trying to sneak up on people mainly right now. Seems like it should be good clear to take him out. Shit, 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 reload, reload. Okay. I got a good bit of people. I'm going to clear out the rest of this area over here. Yeah, 
There we go. He's over on the other side of the wall, don't worry about that shit. Okay, that guy's in that building, I'm not gonna worry about him. Don't have a shot on that guy. Up in the tower. I knew it. There's two other guys outside of him inside the building that he's in. Okay. So they're not on the road here that can spot me when I walk across? Um... I don't think there's anyone who should be able to spot you from there. Okay. Oh, shit. I can't tell where the third one is, because if I have to go in there any further, they'll probably see my drone. Unless I can get him from up here. Okay, that's understandable. There he is. Yep, I found him. So there's Remember, we got a capture. There's one in the middle of the street. Just be careful. I've been this like careful, right? No matter what, when we get to him, it's going to be... A, it's going to be, end up becoming a firefight. Before I take him out, is the other guy looking... No, he's inside. Good. Hold up. I mean, if I take the way I came from, it should be okay. There shouldn't be a firefight. Hold up, I'm gonna see if there's a back. Fuck. Someone saw the guy drop the sniper. Never mind, he just heard me. Hey, bitch. Man of Cereba, let me see those hands. Hola, senores. You're taller than the car usual here. delivery people. I need to drop him real quick, so hopefully he doesn't run. Why? There's Kingslayer file. No. Okay. Let's go the way we came. No, no, no. Hold on, hold on. We're going to go out this back door because there's a car right out here. There's people though. That's what I'm saying. It wasn't. They're on the other side of this wall. We're good. Okay, if you say so. Yeah, All I got is a pistol, so. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Stash him. Can't put him in the trunk, that's stupid. Ripperones. So you wanna get in? Okay, yeah, don't worry about those turrets. I took everyone out there. Oh, it let us out. We good. So, how did you like all my stealthing till the end? You like mine. I still haven't got caught. Well, I mean, tech. Yeah, but you get the point. Yeah, and it wasn't somebody who saw me take the guy out. He heard me shoot because he was right by the entrance. I thought I was more inside. If we're staying overnight, I should probably have me also. I'm not overly afraid of the dark, but the people will think I'm cheating on him. Emilia Flores once gave me a hirapa azul, and Pepito said the nastiest things to him. I had to spank him. Pepito is not Not this guy. Is this guy for real, or is he fucking with us? I think he's what the fuck? Something kept his mind from growing up the whole way. Do all Americans curse as much as you do? I'm supposed to wash away an American this week, but he hasn't arrived yet. Not that it would matter to me if he cursed much or not. I just do my job. I don't judge other people. Wash away an American? You mean put this American in a barrel and cover him with lime? Claro que sí. Some of the other men with guns, they call me el pozolero, the stew maker. 
I don't even eat stool. You just dissolve. Bugs just, just wait. I want to hear this crazy ass fucker. I know. <laughs> Sometimes. Why are you looking at me like that? It's not like I kill these people. Pepito would never let me do that. Yeah, why wouldn't he? Because it's not part of my job, of course. Are you sure we can't go back for Pepito? I'm sure. Don't worry. We'll let him know there weren't any giraffes or any other animals. Gracias. No doubt he'll still pout about being left behind, but if you say it can be helped, then I suppose it can be helped. What the fuck is wrong with this guy? <laughs> Give up. Oh, okay. Just what the fuck? Inigo Morales, district court judge, disappeared on his way home from work. Octavio Rodriguez, student activist, kidnapped by a gang of our men outside a local bar, never seen again. Mirabel Castro, school teacher, last seen at an Unidad checkpoint in Santa Cruz. I remember her. She had beautiful skin, like an angel. There's a thousand more like them in this stack, you son of a bitch, and that's just this year. Every one of them had a family. People out of their minds with grief because their loved ones are gone. But they were dead. What else could I do? Midas thinks he's got the mind of a child. Probably has no idea what you're talking about. Well, he better have a fucking photographic memory. I want the names of every single person you put in one of those journals. I don't care how long it takes. Do you understand me? Yes. Okay. Then you will take me back, verdad? I must get back to work. I was scared of this guy until we started this mission. <laughs> <laughs> no wonder he didn't run away when I let him go. But I sure don't like seeing him in one package. He's not exactly stupid. Like his brain broke? He's disassociated. Exactly. I, for one, am not going to let my face <laughs> burn that. <laughs> <laughs> El Mudo was All outmanned right. and outgunned, and he knew it. What do you do when you don't have an army and you need one? You buy one. Every officer, like every prostitute, has a price. Quiebra el sueño. It was the right move. I would have done the same thing. But El Mudo forgot. Fear is always worth more than money. Nomad. Things are moving fast on Santa Blanca's side of the board. El Muro and El Sueño are at war. Is the Sueño for Muro to kill his own brother? After that, Muro paid Unidad to hit Sueño. Guess that didn't go so well. Not so much. So now we let these assholes wipe each other out? <sighs> I wish. Unfortunately, Muro is one of our only shops at Sueño. They've been best friends since childhood. We need to know everything he knows. Got it. So we grab El Muro before Unidad slips him out of Bolivia. Cool. Good to know. Man, all these grab the fucker missions. And I don't think we can do that in seven minutes. Mm, probably not. I mean, we can go a little bit extra if you actually want to try to do it. But no later than 440, 445 at the latest, because I gotta get ready.